Hello users, welcome to QR Code Chimp. This walkthrough will guide you through the key features and functionalities of QR Code Chimp. Before getting started, let's understand the difference between static and dynamic QR codes. You can create two types of QR codes, static and dynamic. A static QR code isn't editable, and you can't track its scans. On the other hand, you can edit the contents of a dynamic QR code and view its scan analytics. If you're creating QR codes for business or marketing, it's better to create a dynamic QR code for its editing and tracking capabilities. That said, let's start with the walkthrough. First things first, sign into your QR CodeChimp account and head to the Solutions tab. Here, you'll find all the QR code solutions available on QR Code Chimp. We currently offer 35 plus solutions for all the major use cases of QR codes. Select a solution depending on the type of QR code you want to create. For instance, if you want to create a digital business card, select VCard Plus. Let's now create a VCard Plus QR code. Design and customize your VCard Plus display page with colors and images. Enter the details you want to display on your VCard Plus page. Decorate your QR code to make it look unique and appealing. QR Code Chimp offers an array of QR code design and customization features. These include QR code shapes to make your QR codes unique and relatable. Pre-designed for using pre-made QR code designs. Stickers to add CTAs and make your QR codes actionable. Colors to add appeal and vibrance to your QR codes. Shapes to customize your QR codes even further. Logos to align your QR codes with your brand. Decorate your picture to turn your image or logo into a QR code. Play around with these options to create stunning QR code designs. Once you've designed the QR code, you need to save it. Click on Save QR Code. Give it a name. Select a folder if needed, and click on Save. Please note that the process of creating a QR code is different for each type. In case of confusion, refer to the How to Steps on the Generator page. Downloading a QR Code Once you save a QR code, you can download it from the dashboard. Go to the dashboard and find the recently saved QR code. If you've created a single QR code, it'll appear in the individual QR codes list. Click on Download in the Action column of the QR code. PNG and PDF are the two file formats available by default. If you want to download your QR codes in SVG, shoot us an email, and we'll enable it for you without any extra charges. Saving QR codes in folders. If you manage QR codes for multiple clients or campaigns, you can save them in different folders for easy access and better management. To access your folders, go to the dashboard and click on Folders. Click on Create New Folder to create a folder. Editing a QR code. Now, what if you want to edit your QR code's contents? In the case of vCard Plus, it could be the contact information, social media links, etc. To edit a QR code, go to the dashboard and find the QR code you want to edit. Click on Edit in the Action column to change the QR code's contents. Don't forget to save your changes. Viewing QR Code Analytics Now that your QR codes are live, let's see how you can track their scans and view their analytics. Go to your dashboard and click on Analytics. Here, you can view your total QR code scans and their timeline, location, device, and browser analytics. You can also view the analytics of an individual QR code by clicking on View Details for the QR code in the dashboard. File Manager QR Code Chimp also provides a file manager where you can upload images, PDFs, and other files. You can also upload folders containing files for better organization. You can then use these files for creating QR codes. Please note that the upload size limit is subjective to your current plan. Merchandise QR codes. 
If you want to sell products with QR codes printed on them, you can create merchandise QR codes. Merchandise QR codes are empty QR codes of a particular type. Like a pet ID tag QR code. You can print a pet ID tag QR code on your pet tags, and consumers who buy the tags can claim the QR codes. To create merchandise QR codes, go to your dashboard and click on Merchandise QR Codes. You can find the complete tutorial for creating merchandise QR codes in the description. Upgrading to Paid Plan QR Code Chimp offers a generous free plan that will cater to your basic requirements. But if you need advanced QR code creation and management features, we recommend upgrading to a paid plan. To upgrade, go to the pricing page and select a plan as per your needs. Click on Choose Plan, select the plan duration, and click on Proceed for Payment. Setting up Google Analytics Users with a starter plan and above can set up Google Analytics for QR codes with display pages. Go to your account settings and head to the Add Google Analytics section. Enter the Google Analytics ID and click on Save. Creating QR codes in bulk. In some cases, you may want to create dozens or hundreds of QR codes at once. That's where bulk uploading comes into the picture. To generate QR codes in bulk, select a QR code solution and turn on the bulk upload toggle. Download the sample data file and update it with your QR code data. Now, click on Upload Data File to generate the bulk QR code batch. Bulk QR codes will appear in the Bulk QR Code section in the dashboard. You can also edit dynamic bulk QR codes by downloading the QR Excel file, editing it, and uploading it. Add multiple users. Users can create sub-accounts to give access to multiple users for seamless collaboration and management. To add sub-accounts, go to your dashboard and click on Sub-accounts. Create an account ID and click on Create a new sub-account. Enter the user's details, including the login ID, first and last name, and email address. Lastly, choose the level of access and save the changes. The user will receive an email to set the password for their account. White Labeling This feature allows you to replace the default scan and display page URLs with a custom URL, like your company's domain. To set up white labeling, go to the dashboard, scroll down to Settings, and click on Account. Go to the white labeling section and enter the white label URL. And don't forget to update the CNAME records of your white label domain. Advanced Analytics Options Go to your account settings, scroll down to Notification Alerts, and enable the daily and weekly newsletters. In the Emails section, add the emails on which you want to receive the daily and weekly analytics. Additionally, users with an Ultima plan and above can export analytics as an Excel file. Go to the Analytics dashboard and click on Export Data. Enter the timeline for the data you want to download and click on Download. That's all you'll need to get started with QR Code Chimp. If you get stuck and need help, check our knowledge base or reach out to us at support at qrcodechimp.com.